Hi guys, I'm Morgan. I'm your one of your leaders for discussion nine. Uh, for this one, we had to watch two videos. Uh, the first was African men Hollywood stereotypes. Uh, this showed four African men talking about their love and esteem brand and fame, and how many think they could support their fame. Uh, but obviously, they're not kidding, and they're just trying to show that Hollywood has portrayed these types of men in very horrid ways. Um, uh, but in reality, these guys are smart, they're educated, and they're just trying to make their way in the world. Um, it really surprised me about, surprised me to see that these films, how these films showed these guys. I never, I'm not really a fan of these violent films, so it wasn't really, it's kind of new knowledge to me that these uh, African American men were uh, shown in these horrid, violent ways. Uh, so this brings me to my first question. Are there other races or even religious stereotypes in movies that you've seen, especially in uh, more modern, newer movies? Uh, the second video we had to watch was Political Change with Pen and Paper. So it's about how we live in a digital world and how nowadays we get spam emails. We don't really check it as much as we used to. It's not very important to get an email. It's not very personal. Or how if we get um, a call on the phone and it's recorded, it's a recording, we usually hang up and it's nothing important gets talked about or recovered. Um, so uh, he emphasizes the importance of a letter and how a letter, especially handwritten, can really uh, influence, especially those in the political world, and how it, it makes it personal, especially when it's handwritten and how especially po uh, politicians and other people have stated that when they receive handwritten letters, they really appreciate it. Uh, and how this makes these politicians read the letters and really see what your positions are or uh, thanks or any recommendations you have for those uh, politicians. Uh, so my question to you, final question, is uh, can you recall the last time you wrote a handwritten letter to someone uh, if it was to a politician or a relative or someone like that uh, or have you ever received a handwritten letter or a letter of any kind that you still hold uh, hold on to this day or you still remember um, or if it was from someone special do you still have it and what, what did it entail